Hi, everybody. How are you doing? We're the Renegades. This is uh, something new that we're doing. Uh, uh, GR Smash, uh, okay. the channel. Uh, they uh, get a collection of the uh, best moments from around the web from the various tournaments that happen in Smash Bros. Melee. Cool. Smash, or actually, Smash Bros. Melee and uh, just, I think, Brawl, maybe, Project M. Maybe some Project yeah, M, yeah. And Wii U and on N64 as well. Yeah, cool. They Ooh. pretty much go all the way around and collect all these clips of different you know different things like the one we're watching today is the top 10 most disrespectful moments uh in super smash bros this ought to be fun so yeah and also there's like most salty moments weirdest moments Ooh. if there's a lit if there is one of these that you want us to watch let us know in the comments down below we uh, like i'm i'm really getting back into smash bros again and it's and i uh i've been i've been interested in watching some highlight clips and everything like like i've watched I actually went back and I watched the grand finals from 2016 at Evo 2016 Dang. between Hungry Box and Armada and is just like crazy. Uh, like the comebacks that that Hungry Box pulled off were just were just crazy, like amazing. And with Jigglypuff. Oh God. Oh yeah, dude. He he's the best Jigglypuff player in the world, and he is a beast. That is. That's an interesting claim, isn't it? It sure is. Well, I mean, well, just just if you step back from it and think about it, he's the best Jigglypuff player in, in the, the world. world. Yeah. And you're just like, okay, buddy, whatever. Hmm. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah. I mean, and you can back it up, but it's still an odd statement to just yeah. hear. Yeah, it is. But Apropos uh, but, of nothing. But when, just... but when Smash Bros. is going on, dude, I mean, I that's, mean, yeah. I mean, he's... He's really good with Puff. So, without yep. further ado, let's get the video on screen. I don't think I see Kirby, so I'm already excited. No, you don't no, see that's Kirby. that's Ice Climbers. Oh, I'm that... less excited now. <laughs> uh, don't worry, I think there'll be a Kirby. There'll be a too. Kirby in here. I, I think love so. Kirby. So, all right, <laughs> here we go. I, I uh, oh, it's what it's Wobbles and West Ball. Wobbles is famous for uh for doing one thing with ice climbers it's actually been banned at tournaments i think oh no oh my God. i think this is uh, i think this is what i think this is the this is this the thing i think so so oh, show uh, me the thing here we go oh there it is he just oh, leaves oh, oh. Wow. Yeah, West Ball's blocked off. Set's over. One person. Bye, guys. I'm buying a shot. I'll be right back. <laughs> Just grab headbutt, 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 headbutt. Oh, and if they keep up the headbutts just right, they can't escape. Oh, yeah. Oh, arm I remember this one. Oh, he broke his shield. Oh, shield Pulls out break. a stitch face and then hits him into it. woo <laughs> I remember That's that. Armada, just... Armada did him dirty that game, dude. But but Mango still won. Ooh. Good God. Disrespect. Oh, goodbye. <laughs> He rested him. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> That's amazing. <coughs> he did it again. God, man. Hungry box. That's evil. Woo. <laughs> that was nasty. Oh, he barely missed him. Oh, boop. boop. Oh, come on. And he just, he just. Mango's playing fucking amazing. Yeah, oh, this is when Mango was at the top of his game, dude. Mango was. Oh, shine, yeah. shine spike. Yeah. Bye. Damn. Phew. <laughs> wow. Oh, he's going to keep doing... The oh, come on. The wizard spikes. Oh, man. Come on. Just like... Oh, uh, Jesus. Oh. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, goodbye. Oh, buddy. good God. 
fucking dead. Oh, Skull Bowser. Metal Gear. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Snapshot. Okay, that's mean as that's shit. That's disrespectful. That's not cool. Come on, Riddle. What the hell? Ooh! <laughs> wow! I love that there's a guy with a Solaire hoodie in the crowd. It's amazing. Oh, really? More wizard spikes? Come yeah. on! Three! Oh. Oh! Oh! He didn't have to do that! Why? No, he totally didn't! Jesus! Oh, Jigglypuffs! <laughs> Double jigglies. Double jigglies. Oh, this is Mango. Uh, uh, this is Mango and Hungry Box. All, all, every Jigglypuff. Jesus. That was just disrespectful. This is disrespectful. <laughs> Goodbye. This is back when Mango was a better puff than Hungry Box. Hungry Box now is like crazy good with with friggin' Jigglypuff. <laughs> so yeah. That was just straight disrespectful with that, just, with that wizard kick. Oh, that was ugly. That was just like, oh, he didn't have like, to do that. I have never seen anything quite so mean as, I'm just going to I'm gonna pause this and we're just going to save that picture real quick. Uh, yeah. That's, oh, uh, that's, that's just, okay, uh, these two guys right here, this is Mango and this is Hungry Box. These oh two God. at one point were the best puff players in the world. Then Mango actually stopped playing as pu uh, Jigglypuff as much and went straight to just doing Star Fox and Falco. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Whereas Hungry Box maintained playing as Jigglypuff and and has become be the best Jigglypuff in the world. And of all the characters, of all the characters, Jigglypuff. Yeah, that rest is deadly, dude. Yeah, you catch like, him with that rest, it's it's over. Like I remember the knockback. I remember the first time that I ever saw Jigglypuff in original 64 Smash. Yeah, I remember that too. And I was like, why the hell is the down B just... What? <laughs> Me and my friend Andrew it got that too. It didn't make any sense. And then, come to find... Like, I was always just like, okay, whatever. Because I never played... <clears throat> I never really played Smash against anybody. Mm-hmm. And when I did, nobody played as Jigglypuff. Right. Yeah. Then Melee happened. Uh-huh. And I was like, wait, what the hell? Yeah, it's done that the whole time. You didn't know. What? No. Yeah, actually, actually, me and my friend Andrew, we discovered it in the N64 version. Um, there was actually, because you know, he actually had a decent internet connection. and he, <laughs> Yeah, I didn't. Yeah. Those were the halcyon days. Yeah. I tells you what. Yeah. And <sighs> he had a decent internet connection. And whenever I went over to his house, he was just like, Actually, dude, uh, I want to do a test real quick. And what he does, he does a throw up in the air. He does, he grabs, throws me straight up in the air, jumps up, rests, and knocks me and knocks me. And you me. go. I'm like, what? And you go. Where the heck did that come from? The fuck is you? And he's like, the rest is the rest is a huge has like huge knockback. And I'm like, that that's that's immense. That's better than Luigi's up B, which is oh man, it, I love it's better that. than Luigi's Shoryuken, which is saying something like. Yeah, because, like, normally it's just like, oh, that's kind of dull. But if you catch them and you're, like, your fist is right under their chin. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. They're oh, yeah. gone. Oh, yeah. It, it, it's very much a guarantee. Eddie Mexico and Abate are, and actually, I'd say Voodoo Jin as well are the three best Luigi players I've ever seen. Mm -hmm. Eddie Mexico is lucky with the misfires, the Luigi Missile misfires. Oh, he, man. In, in, the fi in one of the finals against uh, West Balls, um, one of the more prominent players mm -hmm. in these videos, uh, him, and, uh, him and West Balls were going against each other, and it was down to one. It was one stock to one, but West Balls had like 70% damage, and was it was on Pokemon Stadium. And you remember the, uh -huh. when the, uh, the, the ledge the ledge section comes up? Yep. And that mm -hmm. little ledge is right there, and it's even with the platform when it comes down? When you when your character spawns in, yep. Eddie Mexico does a misfire off of the platform and 
pegs West balls and knocks him out and and uh, and everybody just goes. Everybody lost their damn what? mind. Everybody lost their shit. Uh, actually, I I think one of the uh, one of the uh, commenters was just like, "Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh, Eduardo Mexico with um, the mist fire." <laughs> and and for I, for those of oh you who gosh. don't know what we're talking about, so. Luigi's side B is the Luigi missile. Yeah. Which gives him quite a bit of horizontal distance. Mm. It's good recovery if you're it's, if you're knocked off high enough. I mean, if you're you know, if you're on it, you can you can do some good stuff with it, but it has a chance to what they call misfire. And the misfire is basically unless you hit something, you're going off the screen. Mm. Yeah, pretty much. But if you hit something, they're going off the screen. Yeah. It has a one in six. Yeah, one in six chance of happening. It's, it's Russian roulette. Like, it yeah. absolutely is Russian roulette. And and hitting one of those feels so good. Yeah, and also back on the shore, you can. Uh, I've seen a bait do this twice in tournaments. Mm-hmm. Hitting a double shore, you can in teams. Mm-hmm. He hits a double shore, you can and wins the game. Good God. Yeah, uh, like, he does. Here was what he did. Uh, the first game he did it, uh, you know, his partner was, was still with him, mm-hmm. and they were being directed. You know, the, his partner had directed his uh, opponent, the second opponent, back to him while a bait was fighting the other. And the the two roll together to control the center of the map. A bait rolls in with him and it's gets just in between like... them. Double sure you can both gone. Mm. Beautiful. And Man. the second time he did it, he was by himself. Oh, good. Two v one. He two v one them, and, and he did that again. Like... And it was beautiful. Yeah, because if that if that hitbox essentially spawns inside the opposing character's model, goodbye. Yeah, the knockback on the up on Luigi Shoryuken is crazy. Yeah, because it's it's either kind of crap or brilliant. Yeah, and in case you all haven't noticed, our favorite character to play as yeah, Nate, Smash Nate and I Luigi. both uh, are big fans of Luigi. <clears throat> yeah, I mean, and... let's be real, I suck at Smash Brothers, <laughs> like. Like I suck in casual play at Smash Brothers. I well, whenever I'm having fun, when I have fun, I, I play as Luigi. Whenever I want to take it serious, I play as either Fox or Falco. Um, see, I don't really have a distinction. I'm just like, I mean, I'm just gonna play Luigi. Although now in uh, Smash Wii in U. Smash Four, uh, I'm a big fan of Me Gunner. Yeah. Because that's, that's a lot of fun. Because it's that right balance between Luigi and Samus. And I'm just yeah. like, I'm in. Yeah, I get that. I mean, that's where I got my only kill against Micah. Well, uh, the me brawler. I remember the one time uh, he was oh, playing yeah. his Ganondorf. Me and him were against each other. And then he comes as Ganondorf. And he does the, the wizard kick to get down to the ground. Quick. Mm-hmm. I do the same thing. And I do my charge up kick. Right as he's about to charge yeah. up his wizard punch, and I knock him off, I knock him off and the stage, like, and I win. Bye. It was just like, oh yes, yeah, I love it was one that. of the best moments for me, dude. And see, Micah's like, man, you know, I, you know, you guys beat me once, and it's it's this whole thing. It's like, yeah, because you're Dark Souls. Yeah, he is. You're a Dark Souls boss. Mark, we're when, going, when, we're going to bash our heads against you <coughs> repeatedly until one of us wins, and then when we get that. That success, it feels so good. Well, when when Micah plays as Link, he's he's okay. But when he plays as Ganon, uh, he, he yeah, like Ganondorf's his main play, character. Yeah, he knows how to play Ganon. Well, I mean, he knows pretty well how to play Link too. Of course, my victory was against him playing Link. Yeah. Um. And so it was like, I mean, that still felt real good. Yeah. Because. <laughs> uh, <laughs> At that point, it's just like retired champion. I'm done. I'm done playing Smash now. Oh, gosh. I'm out. Uh, <laughs> I had surprising success as Bowser Jr. and I had barely ever played Bowser Jr. Yeah, Bowser Jr. is a fun character to play as. He is he's, he's so got fun. a lot. He's got a lot of diversity with his attacks. Yeah, and you're just like, what? Yeah. All, all right. <laughs> all right. And Elena's <laughs> Elena's just over here going. She's just knitting and enjoying her time. Just I mean, like, I was gonna say I miss Micah, but he actually knows about Smash too. So basically, I'd still be here by myself. <laughs> I played Sorry, Melee I... a few times. <coughs> I mean, it's... Who was your main in Melee? Uh, Kirby. Cur- if Kirby was an option, I played Kirby. And well, Kirby's certainly. always an option. Kirby, okay, um, we'll say this. Kirby in the original Smash 64 dude. was probably the second best character I th- after Pikachu. I think I played... 
we the, we had a friend that was that played melee all the time. Yeah, and we made and he was made to play Jigglypuff, um, <laughs> because if he played anything else, we would just die. Right? Even even if he played like Pichu. Uh, I don't remember. If well, to be fair, Pichu. nobody ever wants to play Pichu. <clears throat> he likes to play Marth, I believe. Um, oh, Marth, Marth, yeah, Marth, yeah. I think I played Ness once and did well. Um, <coughs> Ness is fun. Uh, but yeah, I played Kirby almost certainly. If Kirby's ever an option, that's what I'm Man, gonna be playing. I, so, I, uh, which is why I'm in Kirby, the Kirby is, suit when I play Mario Kart. Kirby is <laughs> real fun. Um, so yeah, I think you would have enjoyed uh, Ice Climbers. Ice See, Climbers. I never is tried a good it. One. I don't. I don't know if I would have been able to do it. I mean, they're they're fun. Yeah, but they're just, they are. They're fun. I just I haven't had an opportunity to play it that much because I've never owned a system that had it on it. Yeah, so. I mean we can you know we've we've yeah, got it here. I'd be terrible. We can I'd fix be that. Mad. I'd be terrible too. Well, we we'll play so. together. Yeah, yeah, we'll have to see how things yeah. go. Yeah, like we could team up against Nate and have a chance. Yeah, maybe. I All mean, right, it's, that's what you say. Well, no, I mean like that's the only way we're gonna have a chance. I'm sorry, we're. I'm not very good at games. I'm all right. I'm really bad at Smash. Okay. Well, all right, ladies and gentlemen, we've bragged. We've uh, we've bragged <laughs> gone on about not bragged. Well, we've gone on well, about mean, Smash enough. We had we had grand nostalgia about the times we beat Micah, uh, which yeah. I don't think is bragging those so Halcyon much. Those days because, of of actually beating Micah. <laughs> yeah. And then those videos are just they're like, gone now. Yeah, they're gone. Yes, yeah, Nintendo oh, screwed us over. Yeah, well, mm-hmm. that whole that whole ordeal. Yeah. So anyway, ladies and gentlemen, thank you all for tuning in. If you want to see more awesome uh, Smash compilations, there is a link to the original video down below. Check out GR Smash and all the awesome content that they put online. And uh, I guess until next time, uh, I'm Nate. I'm Ben. I'm Elena. And this is Chico. Oh, cool! Is, I didn't know where he was. He's <laughs> He's a sleepy boy. And we're the Renegades, and we will see you later, everyone. Peace out. Bye.